Bribe Island remains on high alert as firefighters work to contain a major bushfire. The blaze is also creating a massive smoke haze that's spread over Brisbane's north. Ursula Hager joins us now. Ursula, you're not actually on the island, but on the mainland with firefighters as they're now worried about that area. Yes, right now I'm in Tulbul, which is just across from Bribe Island. And as you can see behind me, that massive smoke plume is being blown directly across the Palmerston Passage and into this area. Now, firefighters have stationed themselves just down the road from me here in preparation. They're concerned with that blaze burning and strong winds. It could push embers up to a kilometre ahead of the blaze and cause spot fires anywhere along this area. Now, this fire has been burning for more than four days and so much vegetation has been consumed that this smoke plume is now visible all the way in Brisbane. A thick blanket of smoke and ash hovers over Bribe Island. The plume, the colour of burnt orange, is visible for kilometres. Sitting over Bribe Island and surrounding areas, the result of a large bushfire burning for more than four days. On the ground, it was even more ominous. It just looked like there was like a hectic storm yeah. coming and then like on the other side of it, it was just like really bright red. It was pretty crazy. Worrying too for firefighters still battling the blaze in the north of the island. The smoke plume can carry embers, um, can carry, depending on the weather conditions, quite some considerable distance. Um, and that's what we're patrolling at the moment. Authorities say it's up to everybody to pitch in and extinguish any spot fires caused by the plume. Do whatever it takes. We are all in this thing together and we just want to make sure that this fire doesn't spread. Residents in Torbal have already been choked in smoke. The smoke's really bad actually. We had to shut the whole house up because it was really smoky. Some now preparing their homes for more to come. Uh, most of the residents here have been spraying the tops of their caravans with, uh, with the sprinklers. There is a few locals stressing out, you know, what to do, do I water my roof? It was really eerie. It was like uh, an orange sky. 76 firefighters are still working to protect native forest on Bribe Island. More than 1,000 hectares have already been burnt out. With temperatures expected to stay above 30 degrees, there could be more to come. Now, firefighters do have this bushfire under control. It's no longer threatening homes on Bribe Island, but what emergency services are also concerned about is anybody with respiratory conditions living in the area that are affected by the smoke plume. They say to those people that they should stay indoors with their windows and doors closed and keep their medication handy. Max? OK, thanks to Ursula Hager reporting live there from Torbal.